Mental Health First Aid Australia acknowledges Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people are the traditional custodians of the lands, seas and waterways where we live and work. Mental Health First Aid Australia pays respect to Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander elders, past, present and emerging. Non-suicidal self-injury is when a person deliberately injures themselves without any intent to die. It is behaviour rather than a condition and is often used as a coping mechanism to manage overwhelming emotions or distress. Often associated with underlying mental health problems, self-injury is often a way for individuals to express and regulate their emotions, punish themselves or regain a sense of control. Understanding self-injury, the role of culture and different perspectives can help foster a more compassionate and supportive environment, encouraging those who engage in self-injury to seek help without fear of judgment. This is where mental health first aid training can help. Most people are familiar with physical first aid and the idea that when you attend a physical first aid course, you learn the skills and knowledge required to recognise and respond to life-threatening emergencies and provide a first aid response to a casualty across a range of different situations. Mental Health First Aid Training adopts a similar approach. Our courses teach participants about the different types of mental illness and through our practical action plan, you learn the skills to recognise and respond to someone experiencing a mental health problem or a mental health crisis. Our range of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander mental health first aid courses have been developed and reviewed in consultation with Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people. This helps ensure that participants are grounded in social and emotional well-being from an Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander perspective giving participants the skill to provide mental health first aid in a culturally safe and informed way. This course equips adults with the knowledge, skills and confidence to recognise, understand and respond to an Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander person who may be engaging in non-suicidal self-injury. This strengths-based course ensures participants are grounded in social emotional well-being from an Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander perspective and is tailored to include cultural considerations, protocols and yarn ups. The course teaches participants how to recognise the risk factors that often indicate a person may be engaging in non-suicidal self-injury. Participants learn about the barriers to help seeking how to overcome these barriers and the local and cultural supports and resources available to someone engaging in non-suicidal self-injury. The course also looks at the common forms of self-injury and how to identify the difference between non-suicidal self-injury and suicidal behaviour. Using a practical, evidence-based action plan, participants learn how to approach an Aboriginal or Torres Strait Islander person they're concerned about and how to initiate a conversation about those concerns. They also learn how to offer initial support and safety and how to encourage someone to get professional help and seek cultural or other supports. Research has shown that by attending a course, participants improve their knowledge of non-suicidal self-injury and their treatments and confidence in providing mental health first aid. Empowering individuals and providing them with accurate information and dispelling myths helps create a supportive community that can understand and respond to individuals who self-injure. This supportive environment can be instrumental in helping individuals feel accepted and motivated to seek help and make positive change in their lives. Developed through the expert consensus of people with lived experience of non-suicidal self-injury, caregivers and mental health professionals, the course considers local perspectives and experiences and utilises lived experience stories and Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander photography, film and artworks. This representation matters 
and leads to better outcomes for those participating in training and the people they go on to support. This five hour course is delivered face to face by an Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander mental health first aid trained and licensed instructor who can draw upon their own unique and instrumental local cultural knowledge to enrich course content and enable culturally informed and safe delivery. The course is suitable for workplaces, volunteer based groups and any adult interested in learning more about supporting Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander persons who may be engaging in non-suicidal self-injury.